Hey guys, Justin here. Today I'll be reacting to SML movie, Kendrick Lamar. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and enjoy. Oh, come on, Joseph. Drake totally won that rap battle. No way, dude. Kendrick bodied his ass. No, Drake has more Grammys and more number one hits. Bro, when he dropped Not Like Us, it was over. Nail in that casket. Uh, it's not the coffin. What? The saying is nail in the coffin? Bro, I don't care. Either way, his ass is dead. Drake has more hits than the Beatles. Bro, Drake is a pop star. Kendrick got to pull a surprise. I don't care what kind of surprise Kendrick has. He's not better than Drake. What's going on? You heard of the Kendrick Lamar Drake beef? No. The, the rap battle between Kendrick Lamar and Drake? No. Jesus! You know who Drake is? Yeah. And you know who Kendrick Lamar is? Kinda. He doesn't know who Kendrick Come Lamar on, is. No, you know who Kendrick Lamar is. No, he knows who Drake is because Drake's more famous no, and better. Drake is lame! Alright, let me explain to you the rap battle between Kendrick Lamar and Drake. Okay. So Kendrick Lamar made a song saying he makes better music than Drake. And then Drake said, you wear small shoes for your small feet. What a bizarre thing to say. And you beat your wife. Oh. And then Kendrick Lamar goes, well, you have a daughter you're hiding from the world, and you're a manipulator, and you shouldn't say the N-word because you're not really black. Mm -hmm. And then Drake said the N-word a lot. And then said, well, you, your, ma your manager's banging your, your baby mama. And then Kendrick Lamar said, you're a pedophile. Mm -hmm. And then Drake said, I don't have a daughter. But what about the pedophile thing? Oh, and then he goes, I'm, I'm too famous to be a pedophile. If I was one of those, I'd be caught because I'm so famous. Well, that doesn't make sense. Yeah, so that's, that's the beef. Who won? Well, from what you just told me, it sounds like Kendrick Lamar won. Oh, you. come on. Thank you. Thank you. Drake is bigger and more famous, and he can sing and rap. Kendrick can't sing. Come on, it doesn't even matter. He, Kendrick has bars, dude. It oh, doesn't matter. Okay, whatever. It's so dumb. My biggest fear, though, my biggest fear is Kendrick Lamar dissing me because I don't want to be a pedophile. All right. Junior, Kendrick Lamar doesn't even know you exist. But what if he does know I exist and one day I wake up and he's just dissing me and the whole world thinks I'm a pedophile? Well, I don't think you have to worry about that. I don't know. It's so scary because Drake was so famous and now everyone thinks he's a pedophile. Yeah, it's a valid fear, dude. Do you think Kendrick Lamar could make Taylor Swift a pedophile? Oh, definitely, dude. He's like the Thanos of rap. One snap and you're a pedophile. Oh, I know. Kendrick Lamar is so scary. He's my biggest fear. Guys, did you hear Chef Peepee scream? No. Oh. Oh my god! That was Chef Peepee screaming. Oh, what's going on? Oh my god! <laughs> Chef Peepee, we heard you scream. Are you okay? Oh yeah, I'm perfectly fine. I was applying for jobs on LinkedIn. And, and you already have a job. Why are you applying for jobs? Look, because I hate it here. I hate existing, breathing, and even seeing you every freaking morning, but I'm stuck here. Look, I was applying for jobs on LinkedIn, and Kendrick Lamar is hiring for a new personal chef, and he's coming here to try my food. And if he likes it, I will get hired! Oh no, Chef Pee, -Pee. he's gonna call you a pedophile. The fuck? Listen, your, your cooking is really bad, Chef Pee, -Pee. your food is gross, and when Kendrick Lamar tastes it, he's gonna hate it, he's gonna make a dick trap on your food, and he's gonna call you a pedophile. No, he won't! Look, my food is wonderful, you eat it every night, and I'm no damn pedophile. I like thick white milks. Look, Drake's not a pedophile, but Kendrick Lamar called him a pedophile, so people call Drake a pedophile now. Wait, he, he has that type of power? Kendrick Lamar has the most power. If Kendrick Lamar calls you something, you're that thing now. Look, look, don't worry about it. I, I'm not f afraid of it. I, I can cook a perfect meal, and he's gonna like it either way. Can you please just call Kendrick Lamar and tell him not to come? No, I need this damn job, Junior. He'll probably just call you a pedophile if you cancel on it. What? No, I'm not a damn pedophile. It won't work. Okay, just please just try to cook your best food. Get out of here, Junior. I'm gonna make the best meal ever <laughs> for Mr. Kendrick Lamar. <laughs> Oh, man, guys, we need to do something. Why? Because when Kendrick Lamar tastes Chef Pee-Pee's horrible cooking, he's going to make a diss track and call him names. Or he's just going to not hire Chef Pee-Pee and not need to make a diss track. No, no, no. Kendrick Lamar loves making diss tracks now. Yeah, dude, his finishing move is any career. Yeah, that's how he solves his problems. Okay, so what do we do? Okay, I think what we should do is order food from a very famous restaurant and replace Chef Pee-Pee's bad food with the food from the restaurant so when Kendrick Lamar tastes it, he loves the food. Okay, but if he loves the food and he hires Chef Pee-Pee, the next time Chef Pee-Pee cooks, it'll be bad and he's going to know Chef Pee-Pee lied to him and then he's probably going to make a diss track. Oh, you're right. We're trying to avoid the diss track. Yeah. Okay, what if we order food from a restaurant that's not good, but it's also not bad? Like, it's just mediocre. It's just, it's just okay food. Well, I feel like if we don't do anything, he's going to think it's just okay and not make a diss track and just leave. No, no, no. Chef Pee's food is so bad, it's, it's, it's diss track worthy. It's, it's awful. So we need to order food from a restaurant that's not good, but also not bad. Hmm. Denny's? Denny's. 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 Yeah, yeah, Denny's. Denny's. Yeah. Okay, what should we order from Denny's? A moon's over my hammy. What about a grand slamwich? Yeah, they're interchangeable. Either one will work. I'll order both and we decide which one is not as good. Okay. 
All right, here's the Denny's. Oh, God, Junior, this Grand Slam, which looks like throw-up. What is that? What is that? Oh, uh, yeah, it looks like, looks like throw-up right there. Oh, it's nasty. <laughs> well, look, the moon's over my hammy looks pretty good. Should we give this to Kendrick Lamar? Yeah, I think we should definitely go with the moon's over my hammy, because this Grand Slam, which doesn't look so grand. All right, I'm going to go replace this with whatever Chef Peepee's cooking. Shit Slam, which, right, guys? Shit, it looks like shit. I grabbed the bread. You need the whole thing. Uh, you're gonna piss Kendrick off if you don't get the bread, bro. Mm-mm-mm, mm, Chef Pee Pee, you about did yourself this time. Mwah, a fucking masterpiece. Chef Pee Pee, what'd you cook for Kendrick Lamar? The perfect meal ever, a T-bone steak. Wait, Chef Pee Pee, why is it green? Because it's a dry A steak. The drier, the better. The older, the better. So you just, like, left the steak outside? Yeah, I left it in the grass, you know what I'm saying? Let it get old a little bit. Wait, it's gonna make him sick. It's gonna get you food poisoning. No, it's not. I, I read online. That's what makes it all good and gives it more flavor. Look, just get out of the way. I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. That thing look good. All right, Mr. Kitchen Lamar, I got your steak for you. He's gonna love it. Ooh. Hey, Chef Pee what's the grapes for? It's steaks and grapes. It's a perfect fit. Duh, idiot. He's gonna love it. Oh, that's him. That's him. Oh, my God. Okay, I have to be quick. Oh, yeah. He's gonna love that. Hello, Mr. Kendrick Lamar? Damn. Oh my god, Kendrick Lamar, it's really you! Oh yeah, you really been Drake over. Oh, I listen to all your music, I'm a big fan. Oh, I made you the best thing ever! Damn. Oh, okay. Is, is all you're gonna say is damn? Damn. Okay. Well, come on in, I cook your dinner! Damn. Alright, Mr. Kendrick Lamar, here is your food. Wait, I didn't cook that? Damn. Oh, where's my steak? Where's my steak? You, you, what did you do my damn steak? All right, Chef BB, I did you a favor, so calm down. I didn't want Kendrick Lamar to make a diss track about you and call you a pedophile, so I replaced the steak you cooked with a moon's over my hammy from Denny's. <laughs> Denny's is the worst meal you could choose! Well, hold on, he might like it, we don't know yet. Hey guys, what's going on? Hey Cody, you see that over there, Kendrick Lamar? Oh, is that who that is? Yeah, can you go ask him if he's enjoying his food? Yeah, sure, I can ask him. Oh, Junior, I don't want to watch this. Look, if he's having a good time, he still might hire you. Hey there, Mr. Lamar, my name's Cody. Damn. Oh, is everything okay? Damn. Well, you sure are saying damn a lot. Damn. Oh, I see, that's the name of your album. Damn. Yeah, well, Harry, are you enjoying your moons over my hammy? Damn. Oh, is that a no? Damn. He's kind of a weird guy, isn't he, Ken? Are you talking to your doll? Oh, this is not a doll, this is my boyfriend. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Do you think he can talk? Well, of course he can talk. He's my boyfriend. And breathe? Well, yeah, he is alive. Wait, what are you, uh, what are you writing? <coughs> what? Um, he is a weird guy, isn't he, Ken? <coughs> Don't worry, Chef Peepee. He's probably gonna like the moons over my hand. <gasps> oh, Cody! I need to know. What did he say? Please tell me. Well, he didn't really say much of anything. He just said damn. Wait, damn? Was it a good damn, bad damn, what? I don't know. He didn't even taste the food. What did it taste? I, I don't know. He just wrote down a bunch of stuff and then he ran away. Ah, oh, damn! He's a food critic! Well, what did he write down? I don't know. He didn't show me. Ah, oh, man. Hopefully I'll get my review in the mail in like a week or so. Yeah, it better be good. Let us know what he says, Chef Pee. <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. Ooh, dude, what did Kendrick Lamar say about the food? He didn't say anything. He didn't even try it. Aw, oh, man, I know why. He probably Ooh. thought Drake poisoned it. Shit, I would poison it if I was Drake. <laughs> Ultimate revenge. You just said he was writing stuff down? Yeah, and he asked a bunch of questions about Ken. I told him he was my boyfriend, then he just started writing. Mm, I don't think he's gay, so he's probably not gonna steal your boyfriend. <gasps> Look, the news! That was your line. Oh. The news! Breaking news! Kendrick Lamar has released a new diss track targeted towards a kid named Cody! He made a diss track on you, Cody?! Why? I didn't even do anything! Let's see what he has to say. Zilat Thu Zeb Ewok. Play that shit backwards, it might mean something. I see dead dogs. What's that on that beat, ho? Uh, muscle it on the beat, ho, we know Kids are freaking dog, just believe, yo No way you think that he's alive, be real, bro Carrying around a piece of plastic like a fucking deal, though I'm tired of you weird-ass niggas and your G.I. Joes Plaid shirt, four wise, and you got no hoes You say kids alive, nigga, better check your nose Kick him move and tell me why he can't change that pose Shoot, shoot, shoot Kids a fucking dog He's a dog Bitch, bitch, bitch Kids a fucking dog He's a dog He can't breathe, he can't breathe, he can't breathe, nigga 
God. He can't breathe. He can't breathe. He can't do it. He can't do it. He can't take a fucking breath. He can't do it. He can't do it. He can't take a fucking breath. He a plastic ass nigga and Cody play with dolls. He a plastic ass nigga and Cody play with dolls. Plastic ass. Oh no, Cody. Well, at least he didn't call you a pedophile. Oh, that nigga a pedophile. He like boy booty. He play with dolls too. What? That doesn't even make any sense. I'm a kid. Not gonna lie, bro. That was pretty fire. And it was spot on. I agree with everything he says. But why would he say that? I didn't do anything to him. I'm not a rapper. Well, maybe he saw you being weird with Ken and he just wanted to make fun of you. I mean, you don't do weird stuff in front of Ken Lamar. He'll call you out. Yeah, you walk around with Ken all day. You're just asking for it, dude. But why would Kendrick Lamar say those things? Well, are you gonna respond? Well, respond? I can't respond. What bad things can I say about him? Oh, you're a multimillionaire with a bunch of Grammys <laughs> and a Pulitzer Prize and also you beat Drake, one of the most famous people in the world. Oh, yeah, that'll show him. Shit, say something. Yeah, you gotta respond with something. Well, I can't respond with... What was that, Ken? Well, Ken wants to respond. Wait, he does? Yeah. Well, Ken, I don't think this is a good idea. He's not gonna care about your abs, or that you're an astronaut, or a rocket scientist. He's not gonna care that you were in the Barbie movie, Ken. Probably because he's a doll, dude. He's not a doll, Joseph! And also Kendrick Lamar. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna take Ken to the studio so he can spit. I'm just kidding. Ken doesn't spit. He swallows. <laughs> Loads. But don't say that in the song, Ken. I don't think people will like that. Okay, guys, we're back from the studio. Ken recorded the hardest rap song ever. I mean, he spit bars. I burned it onto a CD and I put it in the PlayStation in front of us. Wait, how old are you, nigga? Well, it's on the TV up there. There's, there's a TV, I promise. We just never show it. But guys, you guys want to watch the music video that Ken made by himself? Let's watch it. Oh, oh, damn. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, you guys hear that? Oh, body, right? Oh, Ken is spitting up there. Where's the lyrics, Cody? What, what are you talking about? He's singing the lyrics. Don't you hear him? Damn. Maybe we can't hear him because he's a doll. He's not a doll, and how can you guys not hear what he's saying? Cody, there's no words to this song. It's just a beat. Wait, you guys are telling me you didn't just hear him say K-Dot? More like K-Not. Can't hang with the big shots. Your legacy's a short story built on weak plots. I'm the truth spitter, a real glitter shitter. You're just a pretender, just a bitter critter. You didn't hear him say that? No. Wait, so you guys are telling me you didn't just hear him say, so here's my diss track, K-Dot. Take it to heart. You're just another rapper playing another part. You act like you're a legend, but let's rewind. You weren't relevant till you just drank. Now give me that behind. You didn't hear any of that? He did not say that, no. What are you guys, deaf? There's no word, it's just a beat. He can't record music because he's a doll. Well, maybe I have to turn up the vocals. I told you, Ken, let me turn up the vocals. Cody, I, I, I've been thinking about it. I think it's just smart not to respond to Kendrick Lamar because then he's going to re reply with even worse diss and even worse diss. And I think what's best is just to ignore him and he'll go away. Okay, if you guys think so. Yeah, just delete that song that you recorded. Dude, what do you think Kendrick Lamar is doing now? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pedophile. <laughs> Die, Drake. <laughs> oh, this'll get him. <laughs> wah, wah.